What's up everyone? Welcome to Profit Data. So today exactly I'm gonna talk about this uh, WebSocket data of files. Okay. So earlier I have been done a video related to this, and I've been already given the code. Okay. And uh, you know uh, to get this uh, WebSocket data, especially uh, you know previously when I uh, installed uh, the newer version of uh, Files API. Okay. There was some problem in a WebSocket data. Okay, so that's the reason I depreciated the files API and then I tried and it was working. Okay, so uh, everything was going good and then initially uh, like you know I just uh, reinstalled files and I've been reconnected the WebSocket and uh, the things were resolved. Okay, so I just say that you know whatever I've been done videos are related to that code you can follow. Okay, so if you just uh, google it out files websocket profit data you will find the code i mean the link of uh, my uh, website and uh, the video of uh, the market data fetching the data okay so i've been already done some of the videos and some of the code which you can check here okay so if i just uh, click over the link and just if i visit you know I, I just have to do one thing i mean i just have to reshuffle certain things and if I guide properly, I'm able to get same certain things in uh, my uh, WebSocket data as in uh, the uh, the order which is need to be reshuffled while getting this WebSocket data, okay, which is uh, very much required. So if you just re uh, reshuffle certain things and if you follow, you will get the proper output, okay. And previously, I've been just shown only like uh, you know getting this uh, this equity. So today, uh, in in this main WebSocket uh, streaming data is uh, like you know to take out those index data, especially with the index data. Okay. So if you just uh, try this code and you depreciate this uh, files API, you will able to get this data. But if you want to get with this, uh, you know uh, with the index data you need to follow certain kind of a proper input which i'm going to show you okay so all you have to do is like you just have to copy this stuff and i think i've been already shown in my this uh this website i mean how you can create all those stuff uh, especially like you know uh, creating app and generating the access token and i think you should follow this uh this generation of API as well as access token it is everything is in the uh, same category same category wise and it is one of the best and e easy to follow okay so generation of access token have been done at an ease manner okay the auth code needs to be followed in a text and some url just paste and get the auth code and then generate the access token so i made it very much simple so if you just go through that video go through that uh, uh, code it will be easy for you okay so just visit then uh, say so suppose if you are getting with this uh, website and uh, i've been already done uh, like an installation of a new python okay and uh, you can follow from that video okay so you can visit my channel which is profit Edda, okay uh, so what you have to do is like say so suppose if you want to get through this idly and you are unable to launch uh, this python ideally i mean if you try with others uh, python editor text editor you might you might fight uh, face difficulties okay generation of uh, access token or getting this data you may be able to generate uh, access token but able to uh, get this ticket data so what you can do is like you can install this ideally which is python uh, if you just visit python.org slash downloads you can do it and i have been already done videos you can follow so if you just click uh, search in windows say idly and if you say file save as okay so what you can do you can get a text editor for your own purpose which you can rename and you can utilize for uh, your own uh, text editing and uh, gen uh, writing python code and uh, looking for whatever you want okay so i think i've been pasted the code so i'm gonna first like you know get with the tata motors and itc data then i will go for for, for further and in this case you need to give this very your app id and access token you've been generated so all you have to do is like uh, particularly you have to give this uh, path 
so this is my path you can give yours wherever you are uh, special so i must say wherever you are generating i mean you don't generate the access token in a particular python itself okay generate keep it somewhere and then try to utilize it it will be more good okay so i kept my in desktop and especially i kept this in a files folder okay so all of my app id and each and everything is in files it, itself okay so this is how my app id and access token is stored in this folder so i'm going to utilize this stuff now what i'm doing i just need to reshuffle it so you know certain things which i need to say as in fs equals so this is how uh, i will go i mean uh, not this one uh, this uh, i will say as a fs dot and uh, you know i will just put below of my uh, fire socket in these things uh, some reshuffle and we are good to go okay so i have been already mentioned the fire socket so i know not required that stuff access token is definitely required symbol and data type which need to be get in uh, subscribe so all you have to do is symbol data symbol comma data underscore type okay and in this what you have to do is like you have to say run underscore background okay so you have to follow the correct syntax if you do you will to get what you are looking for log underscore path you can sing uh, ticket in a comment or otherwise you can give it whichever folder you belong to okay so this is my particularly i mean this folder so i will give this folder in log path so whatever generated error file it will be in my this folder okay and you have to give proper name if if some error is there will definitely won't get the proper data okay and uh, while generation of this uh, data uh, you just have to see that you are doing this in a particular timing which is uh, in your market timings okay then you are able to generate uh this particular data ticker data okay so just simple stuff just reshuffle it and you are good to go okay sorry i mean this uh, files web socket as a module is changed so this will be capital w that's it so just reshuffle it okay we are good to go okay so as you can see we are getting this itc equity and for the flow is there so tata motors itc and uh, this is how we'll get one more thing you can do is you can put this loop uh, you can pass it it on another method okay connect it with other things and try to uh, get this data as per your requirement okay so this is how you can do now one more thing which i already told you like you know particularly i made this video to get particular index data so i want to show you how you can get the index data which i have been not done earlier in uh, files so i'm going to show it to you so the, in this case it is very much smooth so if you just visit files talk uh, there is a some uh, some like you know getting instruments some of uh, url is there same as with others this is free of cost uh, like you know api is available with uh, every broker i mean if if not every broker especially with the files zeroda so i mean every broker offers okay so whichever it comes to this kind of a data just get with these things so so suppose if i have to get with this uh, bank nifty okay so i need to check with my syntax which is very much important so all i have to say is bank nifty uh, so this is if i have to check by with the bank nifty so this is my syntax so if i have to say i have to say nse nifty bank minus index so this is important okay so this is you need to fulfill here okay so this is what i am talking about nifty bank index okay so this is what you can uh, is like you can go with others as well okay but now what happens so suppose if i am looking for uh, nifty 50 okay so this is how nifty 50 will be there uh i mean specially if i talk about i straight away just uh, uh, get in with index only okay 
Okay, so this is how I will get. So NSE Nifty 50 index. So this is what Nifty 50 I am looking for. So I have been already done related to option trading, ATM, ITM. So this is the thing which you need to require and you need to follow. Okay, so this is how you will get uh, the data particular and from this the flow of option change. Okay, sorry, I think so. I have done some mistakes. What is that? Okay, here. So if we are good in each and everything, we will definitely get the data. So this is how I will get the data. Okay, so particularly uh, I will make it a flow and then if I will go with this thing, so it will definitely gonna uh, utilize this stuff. Okay, so now my main purpose is uh, suppose if I have to get with this symbol and then what I require the LTP. So this, this is what I am gonna do. So you start, there is a block is there. So if you just get with a JSON, so all you have to mention that with column you are looking for and what you are looking for. So symbol I am looking for. So in JSON there is already is there. So I will check with the symbol and then I will get with the LTP. Okay. So this is what I will do. Okay. So this is how I'll get the data. Okay, so I can say whatever the trading symbol of mine. Okay, and I can particularly can fetch whatever I'm looking for. Okay, so I got the LTP from that. I will try to find it out as I already told you. Now getting the option chain data. Okay, so this is how you can follow. Another things is already there which you can which you have been seen in WebSocket. Okay, so try to analyze and uh, get as per your requirement okay and if you are missing any certain things i mean what have been already explained okay you can just take it from that video okay particularly get that code and you can try in this same stuff i'm gonna put this code okay below link in the description so check for that okay if you know if you have any doubt regarding this video please do comment below if you have any other queries or requirements please do contact me there via whatsapp thank you